going to start by applying a liquid foundation. I'm using Maybelline's Fit Me Foundation. Next is the concealer and I'm using Sephora's Eye Brightening Concealer. This is optional but because I want the eyeshadow to pop and be long lasting, I'm using L'Oreal's Decrease Eyeshadow Base. I'm now going to take a lime green cream shadow to apply it as a base for the color. I'm using Revlon's Luminance Cream Shadow in the color Electric Pop. Then I'm going to take a light lime green shadow and apply it on top. Give the eye a better angle finish, I'm going to place a small piece of tape aligned with the outer corner of my eye and the end of my eyebrow. Then take in another cream shadow, in this case Urban Decay's cream shadow in the color Delinquent. I'm going to apply it in the crease to serve as a base for the next purple color. Then taking a flat brush, I'm going to blend it out. Take a bright purple with shimmer and apply it on the top of the cream shadow in the crease. And with a crease brush, start to blend it out. Now I'm going to be taking Urban Decay's Loose Pigment in the color process and apply it in the outer corner of the eye to make an illusion of a shadow. Any dark green like this one will do the same effect. Then I'm going to blend it in. Fairies are very sparkly and glittery. So I'm going to take a white glittery shadow and apply it under my eyebrow and in the inner corner of the eye. Now taking an eyeliner brush, I'm going to take the same green we used for the eyelid and apply it in the bottom inner corner of the eye, but only to the first half. going to take the same purple and apply it in the bottom outer corner of the eye. Now remove the piece of tape and slightly blend out the eyeshadow line with your finger. Now take your favorite eyeliner and line your waterline, but do not line the inner corner of the eye. same eyeliner, I'm going to slightly fill in my eyebrows and brush them with a mascara and eyebrow swatch. Now apply your favorite mascara. In the first eye I did, I have a fake eyelash and this is because I was considering to use them in this look but because I don't know how to apply them correctly, I decided to take them out. Now use your creativity with a liquid eyeliner and create an outer corner design. I decided to go with something simple because I can be very messy with liquid eyeliner. Now 
applying a bright blush and if it's shimmering, the better it is. Now finish the look with a light lip color. 